Baba Vanga, the seer of Rupait, in the heart of the Balkans, amidst the rugged terrain and the whispering winds of the Bulgarian mountains, lies a small village called Rupait. It is a place where time seems to stand still, where the echoes of the past blend seamlessly with the whispers of the future. It was here that Baba Vanga, the enigmatic prophetess, spent her life, leaving an indelible mark on those who sought her wisdom. The year was 1923. The skies over Strumica, then a part of the kingdom of Serbs, Croats, and Slovenes, were dark and foreboding. A young Vangelia Pandeva Dimitrova, just 12 years old, played outside her modest home, unaware of the impending disaster. The storm came suddenly, with a ferocity that left the villagers in terror. Winds howled like a pack of wolves, tearing through the landscape. In the chaos, Vanga was lifted off her feet and hurled into a nearby field. When she was found hours later, her eyes were filled with sand and debris, her vision irrevocably damaged. Desperation gripped her family. They were too poor to afford proper medical treatment, and despite their best efforts, Vanga's eyesight deteriorated. Darkness engulfed her world, but it was within this darkness that her other senses began to sharpen, and something extraordinary started to manifest. Vanga's blindness forced her to rely on her other senses, and soon, she began to experience visions. It started subtly a feeling, a whisper, a sense of knowing. At the age of 16, she made her first prophecy. A neighbor's sheep had gone missing, and despite extensive searches, it remained lost. In a trance-like state, Vanga described the exact location of the sheep, deep within a thicket near a river. Skeptical yet desperate, the villagers followed her directions and found the sheep exactly where she said it would be. The news of her abilities spread like wildfire. People from neighboring villages began to seek her counsel. Her visions were often cryptic and metaphorical, yet they resonated with an undeniable truth. Vanga's reputation as a seer grew, but so did the burden of her gift. In 1942, Vanga moved to the village of Rupite, where she would spend the rest of her life. Her home, a modest house with a small garden, became a pilgrimage site for those seeking answers. Her fame had reached beyond the borders of Bulgaria, attracting politicians, soldiers, and ordinary people from all walks of life. One cold winter night, a young soldier knocked on her door. He was about to be deployed to the front lines and was desperate to know his fate. Vanga took his hand, her eyes staring into the void, and told him he would return home safely, but not without scars. True to her words, the soldier returned months later, injured but alive. Her predictions were often shrouded in mystery. She foresaw the rise of Adolf Hitler, the assassination of John F. Kennedy, the dissolution of the Soviet Union, and the 911 attacks. Each vision was a piece of a larger puzzle, revealing the intricate web of fate and destiny. Despite her fame, Baba Vanga remained a humble and deeply spiritual woman. She believed her gift was a divine burden she had to bear. Her visions, while often accurate, were not always a source of comfort. She saw not only the triumphs, but also the tragedies that awaited humanity. Vanga lived simply, accepting only small tokens of gratitude for her services. She treated everyone with the same warmth and respect, regardless of their status. Her door was always open, and her heart was always ready to listen. She was known for her compassion and kindness, often offering words of comfort and hope to those in despair. Vanga's humility was evident in her daily life. She would often be seen tending to her garden, caring for her animals, and engaging in simple, everyday activities. She found solace in nature and believed in the healing power of the natural world. Her home was filled with the scent of herbs and flowers, creating an atmosphere of peace and tranquility. Baba Vanga's influence extended beyond the common folk, she was visited by high-ranking officials, including Soviet leaders and Bulgarian politicians, who sought her guidance on critical matters. There were whispers of clandestine meetings, where Vanga's visions influenced significant political decisions. 
Some believe that her insight shaped the course of history in ways that are still not fully understood. One such encounter involved a prominent Soviet leader who sought Vanga's counsel during the height of the Cold War. She predicted the fall of communism and the eventual dissolution of the Soviet Union, a vision that seemed impossible at the time. Years later, her prophecy came true, cementing her reputation as a visionary of unparalleled foresight. During these meetings, Vanga maintained her humble demeanor, speaking to the powerful in the same manner she spoke to the villagers. She was not intimidated by their status and often provided them with advice that was both practical and profound. Her insights were valued not only for their predictive accuracy, but also for the wisdom they contained. There are stories of secret prophecies that Vanga shared only with a select few. It is said that she had a book where she recorded her most profound visions predictions that were too terrifying or too complex to be revealed to the public. This book, if it exists, remains hidden, its contents a source of endless speculation. One of the most chilling accounts comes from a close confidant who claimed that Vanga had foreseen a great catastrophe that would reshape the world. She spoke of natural disasters, political upheaval, and a period of darkness that would test humanity's resilience. Whether these prophecies will come to pass remains to be seen, but the mere possibility adds to the aura of mystery surrounding her legacy. In her later years, Vanga would often spend hours in solitude, lost in contemplation. She would write in her book, recording the visions that came to her in dreams and waking moments. Those who knew her best spoke of the weight of these prophecies, how they seemed to burden her spirit. Yet, she never shied away from her duty, believing it was her responsibility to share these warnings with the world. Beneath the veneer of mystique, Baba Vanga was a woman who faced immense personal struggles. Her blindness, while a source of her gift, was also a constant reminder of her vulnerability. She endured periods of deep loneliness and sorrow, particularly after the loss of her loved ones. Vanga never married, but she formed deep bonds with her family and close friends. She often spoke of her longing for a normal life, free from the burden of her visions. Despite her inner turmoil, she remained committed to helping others, finding solace in her role as a guide and a healer. Her personal struggles included health issues that plagued her in her later years. Despite the pain and discomfort, Vanga continued to receive visitors, never turning away those who sought her help. She believed that her suffering was part of her destiny and embraced it with grace and courage. Over the years, many people reported miraculous experiences after visiting Baba Vanga. Some claimed to have been cured of illnesses, while others found solutions to seemingly insurmountable problems. These accounts further fueled her legend, attracting even more people to her door. However, Vanga also faced skepticism and criticism. Some accused her of being a fraud, exploiting people's vulnerabilities for personal gain. Skeptics pointed to the vague nature of her predictions and argued that her successes were merely coincidences. Despite the criticism, Vanga remained unfazed, confident in the authenticity of her gift. One of the most famous skeptics was a renowned journalist who visited Vanga with the intention of exposing her as a charlatan. After their meeting, he left Rupai a changed man, convinced of her abilities. He later wrote a book detailing his experience, describing how Vanga had known intimate details about his life that she could not have known otherwise. In her final years, Baba Vanga's health began to deteriorate. Yet, even as her physical strength waned, her spiritual presence remained strong. She continued to receive visitors, offering her insights and predictions until her last breath. On August 11, 1996, Baba Vanga passed away peacefully in her home in Rupite. Her death marked the end of an era, but her legacy lived on. She left behind a wealth of predictions, some fulfilled, others yet to come. Her life and work remain a source of fascination and inspiration for many. In the days following her death, thousands of people visited Rupite to pay their respects. 
Her funeral was attended by dignitaries, politicians, and ordinary people whose lives she had touched. The outpouring of grief and gratitude was a testament to the profound impact she had on so many lives. Boba Vanga's legacy is multifaceted. Her predictions continue to be studied and debated by scholars and enthusiasts alike. Some view her as a true prophet, while others remain skeptical of her abilities. Regardless of the differing opinions, Boba Vanga's impact on her community and the world at large is undeniable. In Rupite, a small chapel was built in her honour, and her modest home has been preserved as a museum. Visitors from around the world come to pay their respects, leaving behind candles and flowers as symbols of their gratitude and reverence. Her story has inspired numerous books, documentaries and films, each attempting to unravel the mystery of her life and abilities. Researchers continue to analyse her predictions, looking for patterns and seeking to understand the source of her extraordinary insights. Barbara Vanga's life and predictions remain shrouded in mystery. How did a blind woman from a small Bulgarian village come to possess such extraordinary abilities? Was it divine intervention? Or was there something more to her gift? Some believe that Boba Vanga had a unique connection to the spiritual world, allowing her to see beyond the veil of time. Others think she had an extraordinary ability to read people and situations, using her intuition to make astonishingly accurate predictions. Despite numerous attempts to explain her abilities, the true nature of Boba Vanga's gift remains elusive. Her story continues to captivate the imagination, inspiring both believers and skeptics to explore the mysteries of the human mind and spirit. In the years since her death, many have sought to uncover the secrets of Boba Vanga's life. Researchers, journalists and spiritual seekers have delved into her past, interviewing those who knew her and studying her predictions. They have uncovered a wealth of stories and anecdotes, each adding to the rich tapestry of her legacy. One researcher, Dr. Elena Stoyanova, dedicated her life to studying Vanga's prophecies. She travelled across Bulgaria, collecting testimonies from people who had met the seer. Her work revealed a complex and multifaceted portrait of Boba Vanga, shedding light on her humanity as well as her mystique. Dr. Stoyanova's research led her to believe that Vanga's abilities were a combination of heightened intuition, deep empathy, and a profound connection to the spiritual realm. She argued that Vanga's blindness may have played a crucial role in her development, forcing her to rely on senses and perceptions that most people ignore. Barbara Vanga's influence extends beyond the realm of prophecy. She has become a cultural icon in Bulgaria and beyond, symbolizing the enduring mystery of the human spirit. Her life story has been the subject of countless works of art, from paintings and sculptures to literature and theater. In Bulgarian folklore, Barbara Vanga is often depicted as a wise and benevolent figure, a guardian of ancient wisdom and the bridge between the physical and spiritual worlds. Her legacy is celebrated in festivals and rituals, keeping her memory alive for future generations. Her influence has also reached the global stage. International media have covered her predictions, and her name has become synonymous with clairvoyance and prophecy. Scholars and spiritual leaders from various traditions have explored her life and work, seeking to understand the universal themes that her story embodies. Every year, thousands of people from around the world make the journey to Rupite to visit Boba Vanga's home and the chapel built in her honour. These pilgrims come seeking answers, healing and inspiration, hoping to connect with the spirit of the seer of Rupite. The journey to Rupite is often described as a spiritual pilgrimage. Visitors speak of a palpable energy in the village a sense of peace and connection that transcends the ordinary. Many leave offerings at her grave, such as flowers, candles and handwritten notes, expressing their gratitude and seeking her guidance. Local guides offer a tour of her home, sharing stories and anecdotes about her life. They describe her as a humble and kind-hearted woman who dedicated her life to helping others. 
Visitors are often moved by these stories, finding solace and inspiration in the life of Boba Vanga. Beyond her prophecies, Boba Vanga left behind a rich legacy of spiritual teachings. She spoke of the importance of compassion, humility, and the interconnectedness of all life. Her words continue to resonate with those who seek a deeper understanding of themselves and the world around them. Vanga believed that everyone possesses the potential for insight and intuition, and she encouraged people to develop these abilities through meditation, prayer, and self-reflection. She taught that true wisdom comes from within, and that each person has a unique role to play in the unfolding of the universe. Her teachings emphasize the importance of love and forgiveness, urging people to let go of anger and resentment. She believed that by cultivating a compassionate heart, individuals could overcome personal and collective challenges, creating a more harmonious world. In recent years, there has been a growing interest in exploring the scientific basis of Boba Vanga's abilities. Psychologists, neuroscientists, and perhaps psychologists have conducted studies to understand the mechanisms behind her extraordinary insights. One area of research focuses on the concept of remote viewing, a phenomenon where individuals perceive information about distant or unseen targets. Some scientists believe that Vanga's blindness may have heightened her ability to access this type of information, allowing her to perceive events and details beyond the normal range of human perception. Other researchers have examined the role of intuition and empathy in her predictions. They suggest that Vanga's deep connection to the people she helped, combined with her heightened sensitivity to their emotions and energy, enabled her to make remarkably accurate assessments of their situations. Boba Vanga's legacy extends beyond her life and predictions. She has become a symbol of hope and resilience, inspiring countless individuals to explore their own spiritual paths. Her story encourages people to look beyond the material world and connect with the deeper mysteries of existence. Her teachings continue to be a source of guidance for those seeking to navigate the challenges of life. Whether through meditation, prayer, or acts of kindness, many find solace and inspiration in her words. Baba Vanga's legacy serves as a reminder that the human spirit is capable of profound insight and transformation. In the quiet village of Rupite, the spirit of Baba Vanga endures. Her modest home, now a place of pilgrimage, stands as a testament to her enduring legacy. Visitors from around the world come to pay their respects, seeking solace and wisdom in the presence of the seer of Rupite. Baba Vanga's story is one of resilience, mystery and profound impact. Her predictions, whether seen as divine insights or extraordinary intuition, continue to captivate the imagination. She remains an eternal enigma, a figure who transcends the boundaries of time and space. In the end, Boba Vanga's story is not just about her predictions, but about the profound impact she had on the lives of those she touched. It is a story of resilience, compassion, and the enduring mystery of the human spirit. Her life is a beacon of hope for those who sought her guidance, and her legacy continues to inspire generations. And so, the legend of Boba Vanga lives on, a beacon of hope and a symbol of the extraordinary power of the human soul. Her story reminds us that even in the face of adversity, there is strength and wisdom to be found, and that the mysteries of the human spirit are as vast and profound as the universe itself. Thanks for watching.